Welcome to our video. Artificial intelligence has become a thing recently and we decided to try it out. We were interested to know what Linux distribution the AI would recommend to new Linux users. Stay with us. Our first artificial intelligence interlocutor was ARIA, the AI language model integrated into the Opera web browser. So we asked what Linux distribution it would recommend to beginner users. And then its number one pick was Ubuntu. ARIA says Ubuntu is one of the most popular and beginner-friendly Linux distributions that offer a user-friendly interface and a large community for support. Its second choice was Linux Mint and then Zorin OS. The fourth place was taken by Manjaro Linux while Pop OS sits in the fifth spot. About Manjaro, ARIA says it provides an easy installation process and access to a large number of software packages. On Pop OS, the AI chatbot claims it's focused on simplicity and ease of use and that it offers a clean and intuitive interface. To summarize, the AI recommends four Ubuntu-based, or we should say Debian-based distributions out of the five picks. Then we put the same question to ARIA, but this time within Microsoft's Windows 11. This time around, ARIA offered us almost the same picks, excluding just one. So it also says that for beginners, Ubuntu, then Linux Mint are the best choices. However, it put elementary OS on the third spot, saying that elementary OS is known for its elegant and Mac OS-like user interface, focusing on simplicity and offering a curated selection of applications. The AI also recommends Zarin OS and Pop OS for beginners, so that makes it all the five Ubuntu-based or Debian-based distributions. We could not resist but to ask, what about Manjaro? ARIA within Windows responded that Manjaro is a popular Linux distribution that is often recommended for intermediate users, but that it can also be suitable for newcomers. Here's what it says about Manjaro. It's user-friendly, offers a rolling release model, is based on Arch Linux, we should say by the way, provides accessible package management, and guess what? Supportive community. Then we decided to put the same question to Microsoft's Bing. Well, both of these are just different implementations of the chat GPT chatbot, according to our knowledge. It offered us only three Linux distributions suitable for beginners. Those are Ubuntu, Linux Mint and Zorin OS, with more or less similar explanations for those three choices compared to its sibling ARIA. Bing also offered us an explanation of what the differences are between these three distributions, claiming each of them has its own unique features and strengths. The chatbot says that Linux Mint is known for its simplicity and ease of use. Zorin OS is designed specifically for users transitioning from Windows or Mac OS, while Ubuntu is a popular choice overall with a large community and wide range of software. So, do you agree with artificial intelligence? 
are those distributions the very ones you would also recommend to new to Linux users? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching the video. If you like it, please share it on social media, give us a like and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. See you next time.